Hello friends, welcome to Infigyan in this very very exciting video of Math Olympiad Challenge. Today we are going to solve one very interesting radical equation which is square root square root 5 plus square root square root 5 plus x equal to x for real values of x. While solving this problem we will use algebraic identities, manipulations, quadratic equation, quadratic formula and we will conclude our result. So let's get started by taking or writing domain of the equation okay from here i can write x greater than or equal to minus root 5 okay and just to observe rhs it cannot be negative because we are taking left hand side as a square root so x must be greater than 0 equality doesn't hold true if i will put x equal to 0 then left hand side would be something some value right hand side is 0 which is not equal so I have written here x greater than or equal to you can write like this now take intersection 0 is not true solution so intersection will give us x positive non zero positive value okay now let's begin the problem by considering substitution and see substitution is not root 5 plus x is equal to y square or root 5 plus x is equal to y. Consideration or substitution is root 5 is equal to a. So our equation will become a plus a plus x equal to x. Now squaring, squaring both sides. So a plus square root a plus x equal to x square. Rearrange the terms. So I will get x square minus a is equal to square root x plus a, a plus x or x plus a both are same thing. Now again do a square in both sides. So it will give us x power 4 a square plus b square plus a square minus 2ab so minus 2ax square okay this is square squaring is done equal to x plus a this equation is very very important how it is right now quartic equation in x x power 4 is there x square is there x is there if you will pick that path then you will find out answer no doubt about that but that path would be little lengthier as well as complicated what i am trying here i will take quadratic in a rather than quartic in x so if i will make this equation quadratic in a see what will happen a square minus 2 a x square minus a plus x power 4 minus x equal to 0. Now my target is quadratic equation in a. Okay. Last step I can write for this quadratic formation. a square minus 2 x square plus 1 times a. See because of I am trying to make quadratic in a plus x power 4 minus x equal to 0. Now this is quadratic equation in A. I will use quadratic formula now to find out A. So let's find out. So our A value is, let me write A. So for quadratic formula it will merge because our substitution is also A. So let me not write anything. A will be equal to minus B. So minus B if I will write then it will become 2x square plus 1. Okay, let me write that equation first. So that equation was a square minus 2x square plus 1 times a plus x power 4 minus x equal to 0. This was our equation. So minus b plus minus square root b square. So 2x square plus 1 whole square, negative square would be positive, minus 4ac. So minus 4 times x power 4 minus x. No problem at all. Done. 
now let's denominator is there denominator is let me write here denominator is 2 okay a will be equal to 2x square plus 1 plus minus square root let's open this so a plus b whole square a square okay plus b square plus 2ab expand this minus 4x power 4 plus 4x this term will get cancelled out then denominator 2 is there equal to 2x square plus 1 plus minus see it is if you will check 4x square shall, let me write directly 2x plus 1 whole square if i will consider then it will give us 4x square plus 1 plus 2 times 2x into 1 so that would be 4x so it is 2x plus 1 whole square now you will cancel this is square and square root so ultimately what is coming out that is 2x square plus 1 plus minus 2x plus 1 put the bracket here and denominator is 2 okay now because of we are having plus minus sign i have to consider two values so i will write plus sign so i will be having 2x square plus 2x 1 plus 1 plus 2 over 2 let us take denominator now comma minus sign 2x square minus 2x over 2 so if i will simplify this then it is x square plus x plus 1 and second one is x square minus x and left hand side is root 5 a a is root 5 now there are two equations we have to solve it for the value of x and very interesting thing is about to come that is let me show you i will consider the first equation as x square plus x plus 1 minus root 5 equal to 0 and second equation would be x square minus x minus square root 5 equal to 0 see what we have to consider that is x cannot be negative so initial calculation you will consider whatever the x coming out with negative value you will immediately reject it okay so this is supposed to be done let's write the equation so first equation was x square plus x plus 1 minus root 5 equal to 0 and second was x square minus x minus root 5 equal to 0 i will solve parallelly okay so this is your c a and b both are one quadratic formula x is equal to minus b so minus 1 plus minus square root b square minus 4 plus 4 root 5 I have written directly okay divided by 2 similarly okay let's finish this one first so it will come out minus 1 plus minus if i will consider then i can write 4 root 5 minus 3 over 2 so i will write two solutions first one is minus 1 plus square root 4 root 5 minus 3 over 2 and second solution with minus sign in between so square root 4 root 5 minus 3 over 2 see this one we will reject the second one let me solve the second equation first then we will talk about after applying quadratic formula we are having 1 plus minus square root 1 plus 4 root 5 over 2 now there are two solutions 1 plus square root 1 plus 4 root 5 over 2 and second is 1 minus square root 1 plus 4 root 5 over 2 now important point 
negative solution we will reject c1 plus 4 root 5 is root 5 is 2.23 so 4 root 5 would be near about 9 9 plus 1 is square root 10 so that value will come around th means 3.14 or 3.2 i am taking so this value is negative so what i will do i will reject this rejected because of negative negative value similarly i will reject this one also because of negative value okay now two solutions are there let me simplify a bit this value 4 root 5 is 9 9 minus 3 is 6 square root 6 is 2.44 2.44 minus 1 so it would be 1.44 divided by 2 0 0.4 7 2 we can consider now come to this solution x will be equal to 1 plus minus 1 plus root 5 if you will check that value then you will get this is 4 root 5 is 9 plus 1 10 square root 10 is 3 3.01 or 3.1 plus 1 4 over 2 so that value exactly is coming out 2.08 so there are two values now once you will put this value in the equation original equation this is the equation let me show you i will put that value so using this see i will write root 5 is 2.23 plus square root of 2.23 plus 0.72 okay it should come out 0. x value 0 0.72 but once you will calculate this value then this value is not coming out 0 0.72 it is not matching it so this is you have to check also okay and see this value is correct if you will put the value you will get 2.23 plus 2.23 plus 0 0.72 you can check also it is 3.144 and you, you can cross check this value it is true so right hand side is coming out 2.08 this is true this is not true. so you will reject this one okay so our final solution is x is equal to what you will write 1 plus square root 1 plus 4 root 5 over 2 which is somewhere around 2.08 this is the only solution for this equation. I hope you like this video. It is little lengthier, but that is very, very good and important for those who are preparing for Olympia. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Take care.